We're here at Hamden this afternoon for the first of two Scottish Cup semi-finals. It's Celtic versus Aberdeen, and I managed to find myself an Aberdeen fan. Alistair, what's the mood in the camp heading into this one? Are you confident? I think you're as confident as you can be. Uh, obviously, it's been a very challenging season for a number of reasons, um, and the mood amongst the support isn't quite where you would want it to be coming into a semi-final. But... What the team has managed to do somehow or other during the season is raise itself for a couple of semi-finals uh, and a couple of games in Europe. So yeah, 38 other teams want to be here today and uh, we've got a, a puncher's chance. Obviously the news of announcing that Jimmy Thielen will join the club in June. Do you think that would be a good boost for these players? They now know who's watching them? I think it must be. And if the players can't raise themselves, A, for a semi-final and B, on the basis of somebody's watching them with a, a contract uh, for next season, then I don't know what will make them raise themselves. Uh, all we ask is that they turn up here and... Uh, produce something for that badge in the jersey because that's been the criticism through the season that too many times in the run of the mill games have not turned up and if you don't fancy it today you'll never fancy it will you is that more the thing then for you today to see a performance some some bit of heart from these players not whatever the whatever the result happens at the end just to see a bit of fight from these from these 11 I think that's the sort of thing you see if you get beat. Um, I think we would take a horrible performance and a one nothing win with a last-minute goal. Um, but you are right. I think in a, in a perverse way, you almost learn more from about the players today um, by what they produce and what happens happens with the result. But you know, I, I would much rather be coming back here at the end of May um, after a, a horrible day today uh, and enjoying a chance to win a cup. But uh, the players have just got to produce some. There's a big crowd coming down in challenging circumstances. Um, and we've just got to make it our day today. You spoke about those challenging circumstances. Half 12 kickoff. Talk me through your morning. How, how early did you have to get up? How did you get here for well, this 12 o'clock kickoff? I actually live down in Preston, so, uh, but it's a similar sort of distance coming down from Aberdeen. Um, so we come up last night, um, early start uh, this morning to get across to Hamden. Um, but, you know. <laughs> As an Aberdeen supporter for a number of years, if you're going to win cups, you're invariably going to have to beat Rangers and Celtic in Glasgow. So none of this comes as a surprise. The same arguments about tickets and advantages for Celtic and Rangers, etc., happens every time. It's 11 against 11 in the park, um, so there might be more in the crowd, there might be more people wanting them to win, there might be all sorts of reasons why we shouldn't, but in two hours' time, we've got every chance. Score predictions today? 2-0 Aberdeen. 2-0 Aberdeen, perfect. Well, thank you. It kicks off here at the National Stadium at half 12.